Hey guys, this is Snack Attack 8, and welcome back to more Final Fantasy 9 Blind. That's still weird to me how much that sounds like the same word, 9 Blind. Final Fantasy 9 Blind. This is part 5. In between episodes, I saved, and I found me a leather hat. <laughs> and now that we're ready to go, I'm gonna go, because I'm ready. I ain't holding back. Oh, are we fighting Baku for... Oh man, this is a challenge. If we beat him, we get to leave the ship. But if he beats us, we don't get to leave the ship. <laughs> look at, look, they built like a whole environment for this. This is crazy. Like, I guess, I mean, like, that's not an un-Final Fantasy-like thing to do is have unique uh, battle locations, but it is really cool that like, that we had one for the Prima Vista and now we have one for the burned Prima Vista. Tell me some good detail. Look, Baku, are you sure you don't need to, like, sleep it off a little bit more? That tickles. What a boss-like thing to say. I wonder if I can steal from him again. We can give it a try. He's really not doing very much damage, to be honest. Oh, an iron sword? Man, you really can get some good stuff. I really like that part. This one goes, like, I don't know. <laughs> It's a fun part to sing. Gotta fight better than that. Look, I have like 10 potions, dude. You're not gonna beat me. I do like your stance, though. I always like that, like, sword fighting stance where they kind of hold the sword, like, pointed almost in, like, the wrong direction and, like, out uh, over the head. I don't really know what the point of it is, but it looks cool for sure. I see it in a lot of, like, uh, anime and anime games, fighting games, stuff like that. Pretty sure there's a soul, soul caliber character who holds a sword that way. If Baku gets one more attack in before I can heal, I might die, actually. Good. Oh no, he, he beat me! Oh my god, I shouldn't have stolen. I should have healed is what I should have done. Well, sorry Garnet, we failed. Wow. When was the first game over we got in Final Fantasy VII? It was, uh, not this early. It was certainly not part five. I feel disgraced. Well, whatever. We'll load it back up. I, I saved in slot two this time, actually. Wow, that was stupid. <laughs> when was our first death? Like, uh, the Midgard Zolom thing, right? Wasn't that it? <laughs> that certainly is not this. Let me get that hat again. Alright, let's do this a little bit differently. I, I totally was like talking about some stupid thing and I didn't even realize that I was that close to dying. We only have one party member though, it's like you never really quite know. You gotta go about things in a different way. Alright, Baku. I'm not so uh... I'm not gonna leave you so un... so defended this time. Coming right at you. I am gonna steal first though. Get a little usage out of that uh, trip. There's the iron sword that time, so I know he has an, uh, a high potion to steal too. Uh, which I probably want. Because high. Oops, it's on it. High potion is good. Uh, I don't think we have any of those yet. That would just, at this point, completely heal. Well, I mean. Man, I don't know. Maybe it's not so useful right now. A regular potion pretty, pretty adequately heals us all the way up. Ow. You clonked me. I got two turns to uh, get another hit in, and then I probably want to use a potion up. Unless he trips again, in which case I might be able to get three. Oh man, jump slash. Now we should probably heal now. I, I'm <laughs> not gonna repeat my mistakes, okay? The definition of insanity, you know. Is that even like a real thing though? Who's, who is it that said that? Someone should leave in the comments who said that definition of insanity thing. Because you hear it all the time. But it, I feel like at this point it just people like bring it up and it's like too used. I don't know. Though it's true, like if you keep doing the same thing over and you're failing, then you're not. You're doing something wrong. Dude, stop jump slashing. Alright, I got, I got another hit I can get in though. I can't imagine this is gonna take that long. Are you going to attack? Alright, so we should probably heal for this one. That Skull Bash looks like it hurts, dude. I've never headbutted anyone, but 
What a way to start a sentence. I've never headbutted anyone, but I feel like it would hurt really, really bad if you did. I don't know. But at the same time, I feel like it would just be like the badassest way. Like if I ever did get in a fight, I would almost like kind of want to do one of those just uh, to like throw my opponent off. I don't know. Are you like kind of a pig too, Baku? You look a little piggish. Get those cute like pointy ears. Or a bat maybe? He looks like he's got kind of like a pig nose. I'll be damned. Bravo! Punch me in the gut and I just keel over, can't even go. Go find your princess. Ow. <laughs> that hurt. He pulled his punches till that last one. That was because he was mad. That's because he, he, I think he wanted me to go, really. He had to put up a, a tough front for his, uh, for his crew, though. But I think he knew. Held back on me until the very end when he was like, you stupid son, son of mine. Why are you running away? All right. So let's grab Steiner. Now that we've set our, our parts with the boss. We can get, well, I guess we gotta get, do we have to get VV too? Get our, our, our buddies and, and head out on the, on the mission. Is Steiner even gonna wanna join us though? Come on, too old to be playing with the doll. Put it away. But don't give it to Cinna either, cause just, just trust me, don't. I'm overwhelmed with concern for the princess. If only you rogues hadn't kidnapped her, this is all your fault. It is kind of our fault. But she wanted to go, so it's, I mean, we're not entirely to blame. You need to take a chill pill, Stein. I'm gonna go look for her now. Come with me. Promise to be good. What 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 say you, Rust Bucket? I'm Adalbert Steiner, captain of the Knights of Pluto. Yeah, someone was someone uh made a comment noting that it's interesting that you can change Steiner's last name, because that's like what he's he's called in, in his name, but his first name is Adalbert. Uh, which is really weird. I don't think there's any other Final Fantasy games where that's a thing. Though not all the Final Fantasy characters have last names to begin with. A lot of them do, though, I guess. Figure you were a private. Yeah, you don't look super captain-like. But I've seen your- I've seen your- your, uh, your troops, so... Compared to them, I guess you look okay. Something I decided on my own. Better not be lying. Okay. Well, it looks like he's, uh, we, we, he's, he trusts us some, even in some very small degree. I'm only going with you to rescue the princess, deal with you personally when this is over. This reminds me of some other relationship, um, from some game or movie. What is it? Uh, yeah, we're gonna go see Master Vivi. Uh, oh. Huh. <laughs> so I guess he thinks Vivi is some like great shaman. He definitely does have some magical ability though. He seems like he's pretty uh pretty slick with it. I'm grabbing this. I've been looking at that chest for like an entire video. <laughs> Alright, let's look at uh Steiner's equipment too. He has a broadsword. And the iron sword is better than that. By uh, quite a bit. Um I don't know what minus strike is. So here's what, so okay, so flea is that red, is like this minus strike attack. It has this like red gem thing. Um, so I'm almost wondering if like, that means it'll like be a personal skill. So maybe this is one of Steiner's sword arts. And if I equip the iron sword, which I'm thinking I'm gonna do now because, um, I don't see this beast strike ability or beast killer ability being that useful and I want to see if I'm right about this the sword art thing and this does give four attack which is good I'm gonna equip this weapon um, huh but ru rubber helm has the same ability on it so I guess it would depend on whether I wanted oh that's not better though okay never mind uh, we don't have any other stuff right this bird killer, bug killer. So Steiner has a bunch of like killer abilities um, that I guess you would use on their on those respective types of enemies. Let's put those on him, right? Let's 
let's see. Lethal damage to insects and flying enemies. So that's pretty good. So we'll want to attack those types of enemies with Steiner, right? Because it'll do better. And then... If I go into status... Can I see his sword arts? I can see that they're like a command of his. Or maybe we'll have to go into battle first before that. I think that must be a sword art though, if it's red and Zidane, the skill flea that Zidane can use is also red. Um, it's my hunch. Vivi was up here, right? I wanna see if we got anything new for him too. We have that shirt or, or whatever that, no he wasn't, that's where Baku is. Where was Vivi? He was down to the right down here? Past Mercus. What do you have to say? Hard to beat the boss. Sure are something. We didn't we already beat the boss before? I guess all three of us together beat him. But like he's definitely pretty strong. He beat he he'd knocked me out once. <laughs> if only he was if he was using his full strength, I might not even been able to beat him with just Zidane. Alright, Vivi, we're ready to go. That's great. You're coming with us! <laughs> Come on, bud. I can't do anything. You definitely can. Hardly, Master Vivi. Your magic was highly effective against that monster. In all honesty, I hold your power in greater esteem than I do this scoundrel. You can do it. We'll be right there with you. For the sake of Garnet and all of Alexandria, I humbly request your assistance. You're a black mage for crying out loud. Show us what you got. Give a little boom bam. Some black magic, some flame, some zap. Okay. Try my best. Thanks, Veeves. Can I call you Veeves? It's about your blood. Oh, I don't like this. I was wondering if. What is, is he gonna? Magic sword. Oh, are we gonna get about to get Chrono Trigger up in up in this? That would be crazy. Are there like combo team attacks in this game or something? Let's look at Vivi. Um, okay, so fire. Okay, so I think I'm right, because this is a red skill, too. I don't know why that's different than, like... Oh, Vivi can't even use that. He can do this, though. I, that For sure he wants that, because he can use thunder now, right? Leather wrist. He can take that, too. That's good. It looks like Vivi can't use cure. He's a black mage, so that makes sense. And he can't use beast killer, because that is and he can't use protect girls either i guess some of these abilities must only be accessible <coughs> oh excuse me to certain classes which is why zidane and uh i wonder if steiner can learn protect girls no it seems like th these two can pretty much learn the same uh or use the same skills um but Vivi is different because he's a mage. Leather hat. Already has that. So he'll have fire, blizzard, and thunder. But he can't use beast killer or cure. But that does boost the stats too. So I think we're good. Do I have to equip those onto him? No. He has those. Okay, wait, wait, wait. So. Alright, so this is a sword art. Damages with the difference between your max HP and current HP. So that's like a desperation move, almost. That's why it's called Minus Strike, I guess. So that'll be good in like a... In a sticky spot. Which is not something you ever want to encounter. Sticky is, is gross, always. <laughs> Alright, cool. It looks... It seems to me like I'm at least figuring things out a little bit. I probably don't have it all yet, but... Um, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. You really dig her, huh? Can't sit around knowing a girl's in trouble. It goes against my nature. You're full of crap. You just, look, you wanna, it's a personal thing for you, Zidane. <laughs> Jealous that I'm gonna get a sweetie pie. She's not even my type. Blank seems like the closest thing to, like, a cloud character in this game. <laughs> Came down here to give you this. You're always thinking about me, but I won't need a love potion to reel this one in. What is it? Medicine I gave to the black mage in the night. It's a seed remover. Okay, so we probably will have to use that when we fight the, uh, the plant thing. Why are you helping me? Is it because you're in love with me, blank? 
I know we've spent many a play together. Don't forget to set your abilities. Leaving the band is your business, but you better keep training. Learning more abilities is going to make you even stronger. Okay, so I knew that. Um, oh, so, okay, maybe Blank is going to explain what I just kind of tried to figure out on my own. So basic. Only an idiot wouldn't know how to do it all the way. Open the menu, select ability, select equip, choose the abilities you want to set. Alright, I figured that out already. <laughs> so at least for that much, I'm ahead of the game for that knowledge. Um, I think we will save. We'll just do it in, the, in a different file or something. Just because I get scared about... Well, I don't want to, like, have to do everything over again. Whoa, why is this one still gray? That's really weird. I guess it's because my menus were gray back then, but everything is blue now. That's bizarre. Okay. Alright. So, now if we die to a boss or something out in the wild, we won't, uh, you know, have to do all that stuff over again. Scrap a whole episode. Play an entire episode's worth back to where I was. You hate to see that. And now we get to fight some battles with our, our big ol' party. Our three guys. And this dude's not even facing the right way. So I'm gonna gank something. I'm gonna... Have you... Honestly, we can probably just damage this guy by attacking. Vivi. I mean... He does... Oh, man! Was that a critical? Must have been a critical from Steiner. He doesn't have Beast Killer equipped. So that wouldn't have been like an active thing for him to use. Hmm. That was a lot of damage, though. I don't know if it's that new sword. Maybe he's just strong. I like it, though. We kind of have a, a party coming together, for sure. Orchestra in the forest. Is this going to be our band members? They get a, a an active time event? Yes, it is. Let's really liven this place up. Let's let our music do the fighting against those monsters. I like this song. It's ought to boost morale. <laughs> what, this... Didn't this play in the game? Was this in one of the FMVs or something? I know I've heard this song before. This is great. <laughs> brum, brum, brum. <laughs> is this Baku gonna tell him to knock it off? Not bad. <laughs> I'm gonna take a look around. Stay on your toes. I'm gonna boost morale by playing a song. That's nice. I like that one. All right, back on track though. We got a girl to find. I really like that transition into the battle too. It's really nice. Like a, I think Final. What did, what did Final Fantasy VII do? It kind of did the same thing, didn't it? It's a little different looking though. All right. Um, uh, sword magic. Okay, so that this must have been what Steiner was talking about. Let's try it. Can I? I want to see if I can attack all enemies at once too. No, why am I on my? Oh wait, I didn't even see what it looks like. I should have seen what it looked like. Maybe I, maybe Vivi won't kill this guy. Of course he did. <laughs> Man, we're just strong, I guess. I thought that was a critical before, but Vivi's magic did about the same amount of damage to that goblin that Steiner did to the, the Fang. And they got levels, which is good. Yeah, I want to, like, because there's no all materia or anything like that in this game. I kind of want to see if I can multi-target enemies. And if so, like, how? Unless there is, like, a, a different ability for fire all instead of... Oh, I'm facing the wrong way. Can I do my thing? No. Of course not. That's not in the game anymore. <laughs> Dang darn. In 7, you could just get right back facing around because... If you press, if you tried to run away and then came back, it, uh, it, like, reset. Alright, let's see that sword magic. Pretty cool. That's definitely cool. Um, 
Does anyone need healing? Steiner could use... Or no, Zidane could use some healing. No, I don't want to do that. There we go. Steiner actually could use some too, but... Uh, what else do we got? Flee, I don't want to do that. I guess we can steal from you. And... Doesn't have anything. Okay, so that must be like the you can't steal. Wait, what is this? Change. Defend. I think I Oh, and you can skip. Okay. So I want to skip... Oh, now my other guy's dead, though. I got These are things I gotta figure out, right? Like, whether you can multi-target magic and stuff like that. So for our next battle, that'll be our first priority, is to see if you can do that. And if, if there's, like, any button I need to press to do it or not. Everyone seems to be getting pretty on their way, though. We're making some levels up. Getting some AP. Let's check that stuff. I came up with an idea, like, off... In between episodes actually that maybe the more like AP you get like this because these abilities right now are dependent on the armor and weapons that we're wearing and using but maybe if we get enough AP we'll like permanently get these as abilities that's my idea it's kind of like it kind of reminds me of Magisite like if I'm right it reminds me of the uh, the Magisite um, like, like, system in Final Fantasy VI. Because that was kind of like... Originally, you would get abilities if you had them on the Magisite you were use, you were wearing. But if you, you... Fought with that enough, you would, like, learn those abilities onto yourself. So, I don't think that's too far-fetched of an idea. It might not be exactly how it works. But I'm thinking that is possibly what the AP is for. Either that, or it'll like level our equipment up in some way, and give us stronger abilities on that. There's a big flower. Oh, this thing's- oh no, I thought it had a little face, I was gonna call it cute. But it doesn't, it's really not that cute. So, this is using Steiner's MP to do these sword arts? That's weird. Cause he doesn't have very much. <laughs> so, I guess those should be kinda used sparingly. And I mean, he's, like, obviously strong without him. So let's save those ability for bosses. Sounds like a good idea. Another level. We're catching up. Gotta keep up with the best boys if you're gonna fight the rest, boys. <laughs> what? Oh, man. I didn't even know there was... Oh, man. There's a way to go over here. Some kind of waterfall. I wonder where this river goes. Can't really go over here. Huh, I wonder if there's going to be some importance to that later on. I'm trying to walk up against walls and stuff as much as I can. Um, just because I know there's hidden stuff. Huh, I hope we can... Well, I don't know. We're, I'm scared now to continue much further because I know that Garnet is... Like, I'm for sure we're going to have to fight a boss before we save her. Oh, there we go. Um, okay, so it seems like L and R. Oh, whoa, what? Wait. Oh! You can see it right here who it's targeting. L and R make you target multiple enemies. Is Vivi blind? How did that happen? Did he get blinded in the last battle and I just didn't notice? He hit him anyway, but it sure looks like it. Good thing we have eye drops. Oh, it, it, he has a little blind uh, status ailment on him, too. Did that happen in the beginning of this battle, or did it happen in the last one, and does it, like, carry over? Did blind carry over in 7? I don't think blindness did. That's no good. We'll get rid of that. And... We might want to heal... You up. The other two have enough HP to survive some attacks. But little Veeves is gonna need some, uh, some, some tender love and care. <laughs> oh, here's a Moogle. Excellent. Dude, these Moogles are so helpful. They really are. Oh man, is this thing gonna heal me? This little spring? It looks like it totally will. Which sucks, because that means I wasted a potion. Zidane, you need to do more stealing. No signs of any monsters. This must be a safe place. A spring. Alright. Do as I say, not as I do. 
I do like these little active time events. They seem like they're kind of a cool little thing for extra story. Are you sure about this? Don't worry, we'll be out of here soon too. Take this map, it's gonna be a long trip back to Lindblum. Um, is he sending Blank and Marcus away? What was going on there? All right, so can I heal here? HP, MP restored? Yes. <laughs> I'm too good. Too good, guys. <laughs> I swear I haven't played this. <laughs> it is blind. Can you imagine if it wasn't? What a s just shitty thing that would be. Uh, Monty, you're not the Moogle. Yes, you are! Okay, excellent. I'm gonna give you this letter from Koopo. Thanks for the delivery. How does Koopo know somebody from this far out? From Koopo to Monty. I think Queen Braun is up to something. But I suspect Princess Garnet even more. Oh! She might leave home soon. With a prince on a white horse. Well, <laughs> wasn't exactly how you imagined it. Princess Garnet, didn't she just... <laughs> oh, so she must have come through here. Alright, so does Monty have a letter he wants to deliver? Okay, so I can read this letter again if I want to. Oh, did he s For what? From Stiltskin to Monty. Didn't we meet Stiltskin too? Um... I, I skipped through that a little bit. I shouldn't have. Uh, I'm in a very cold. Oh, Stiltskin was that little uh, delivery guy. He was in the. He was in the first episode. I'm in a very cold place right now. It's really strange. It wasn't like this last time I came here, but I guess this is why I travel to encounter the unexpected. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here before I get trapped in ice. Or he wasn't a delivery guy, but he was like a traveler or something. He was there when we were talking about uh, letter delivery. Um. Old place. I know where he is. There must be something strange going on. Alright. Um, so those are the two letters we can read. I want mail. Alright, so all Monty doesn't have any mail to give. He just has mail that we can read from other Moogles. Okay. Um, Alrighty, so I think that's actually going to... Since this is a good midway point in our journey through the forest, it seems like... That is going to be it for this episode. So we we fought our boss, even though we uh, it didn't go as smoothly as we might have wanted, and have set out into the forest with our new gang to save Dat Gurley. Till next time, guys. I've been Snag Attack Eight. Thanks so much for watching. See you in the next video. Later.